நெல் மர பறவை நெல் மர பறவை கேன் யூ சி நெல் மர பறவை ஃப்ரம் திஸ் புக் வி ஹவ் ஆல்ரெடி ஷேர் சம் ஸ்டோரிஸ் ஐம் கோயிங் டு டெல் த ஸ்டோரி ஒன் ஸ்டோரி டுடே சேம் ரிலேட்டட் டு வாட் ஸ்ரீ வித்யா டோல்ட் ஸ்ரீ வித்யா ஸ்டோரி வாஸ் அபவுட் ஹவு தே சேவ்ட் இன்ஸ்டெட் ஆஃப் ஒன் பிளான் தே சேவ்ட் டூ பிளான்ஸ் கரெக்ட் ஸ்ரீ வித்யா அதான உங்க ஸ்டோரி துளசி ஓகே செடிய ஓகே கோவில் ராஜா மாமா ஒன்லி ரைட் ஸ்டோரி ஐம் கோயிங் டு சே யானை படை விச் மீன்ஸ் எலிபென்ட் குரூப் ஆஃப் எலிபென்ட்ஸ் யானை uh before starting the story i want to ask you one question have you ever traveled through the forest on a road and you were looking both sides see see if any elephants are coming any bears are coming yes jainti aunty has gone which forest have you gone aunty mudumalai forest mudumalai forest what animals have you seen i actually animals may come any time. so we went for a ride but it was so nice we could catch the we could uh, take the um, that uh, what is that um, fruit and all we can pick up sitting on that elephant top no we can just pluck those fruits from the trees and eat it was so nice super nice okay have you any anybody else has gone driven not it you want to go ma'am அம்மாக்கு <laughs> 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 amma konja relax pannitu okay ma seri okay we all enjoyed right when we go into a forest in a car or a jeep or on elephant we really love that but i'll ask you one question the forest who lives in the forest animals live in the forest am i correct so a forest is animals house home we all have a home no what if somebody comes and puts a road inside our bedroom inside our hall inside our balcony and say oh shrinithi lives in a beautiful house i would like to make a road and i want to drive my car will you accept no. No. but but do we even think for a minute inside a forest when there is a road we are very happily driving on the road and if you see in a forest the roads are empty not only driving or riding we do we go very fast also yes or no and what yes. do we do one more thing if everything is silent no noise okay very peaceful the forest is so peaceful serene and calm and quiet 
when some things are calm and quiet, the surrounding is calm and quiet. What do we do? We bang the horn. Yes or no? Pa, 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 ki, 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 ki. We somehow enjoy, right? Is that correct or not correct? Not correct. Not correct. Not correct. Super. Okay. Ma'am. Sorry. Ah. And uh, we also pollute the way, like when you go, the smoke comes out. Exactly. The smoke comes and we drink water. Some people drink beer. Isn't it? Hot drinks. And they throw the bottle just like that. Happily, they just throw the bottle and it goes and hit against a tree and broken glass falls on the ground. And when the animals are walking, especially the elephants are walking, they have a very spongy, soft uh, sole in their foot. So the glass goes inside and many animals die. So that this story will see what is this story about. So you know in a forest one day, all the animals were very, very upset. They were like feeling very uncomfortable. They were jittery. They were like disturbed because of something bad has happened to them. One deer was telling to the other deer, see what, how can these uh, things happen to us? This is too much. This is very bad. This is a blunder. This is not even a mistake. It's a blunder. How can this happen to uh, inside our forest? How can this happen to us? And the monkey said, yes, of course. I agree with you totally. If this is going to be the daily routine, permanently going to happen, how can we live in this forest? And there come a giraffe. Slowly giraffe came. Giraffes are very fast. But giraffe that day was very sad, no? So it was coming very slowly, 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 sadly. It said, yeah, something has to be done. I hope today this uh, our uh, Lion King will take a decision and will ensure something nice is going to happen to us. And when they are talking, one small rabbit, bunny rabbit came there with its friends. It told, hey, what are they? Why are every why is everyone sad? What are they talking to each other? What blunder somebody has made? What danger has come to the come to us? What danger is going to happen in the forest? So it was asking. The other friend told, rabbit, other rabbit told, shh, don't talk anything. They are all big, big animals. Monkeys, deer, giraffes, and all are here. We are very small animals, no? Show, sure. let us keep quiet. Fingers on the mouth, it told. Oh, is it? Okay, okay. Anyway, every animal is here. So we'll also sit and watch. Uh, if we can help, we'll also help. That is what the other rabbit told. And they are all waiting for the lion to come and start the meeting. And that time, more animals are coming. Tiger is coming and uh, uh, bears are also coming. All the animals are coming. Even crocodiles are walking, walking, walking and coming. And you know, this everybody is upset. But the more upset animals are the bears. The bears not only upset, the bear family was also crying. They were crying so much and sadly they came and sat there. So the tiger also has come. And now the last, the lion is coming very majestically and coming and sitting on a rock and says, okay, now the tiger says, so namaste, vanakkam, ellarkum vanakkam. You all know why are we assembled here? Everybody shouted, yes, yes, of course, we know, we know. And the elephant told, see, not only today, for so many years, years together, these human beings are troubling us. So enough, we had patience, kept quiet quietly. We told them not to do so many things we did. We tried, 
but today is the day i can't be patient any more we have to make a decision and we have to stop this nonsense and every animal started shouting yes 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 we want solution we want solution we want solution see and then the lion said wow roar and said yes we will find a solution today okay you all told about what you wanted to do but let me also speak today because i am the king so it said friends these human beings in the name of development they are coming and intruding in our forest they are coming inside our forest and they are making us suffer first we have sent our monkeys to talk to them we told them not to disturb us they did not listen to us they we told them okay you want to make a road we'll give you some land but ensure our animals they don't get hurt that also they did not listen we sent monkeys to talk to them and now yesterday they were coming very fast but the some bears were actually crossing the road because they wanted to go drive very fast and the bears came in between they stopped the vehicle and they have kidnapped our bears what did they do what did they do yesterday kidnapped the bear kidnapped they have taken away they kidnapped the bear cobra they kidnapped yeah, the bear. sad bears yeah this the bears so that is why the bears family they lost one bear they don't know where that bear is being kept so they are all upset if one of our family members our father mother or our uncle anybody has been taken away by somebody will we feel sad or not will be Bam, crying no sad. yeah Bam, which crying. bear was kidnapped which bear i think the father bear was kidnapped the father bear must have been walking to get some food for the children so they have taken away they were very angry hey this is our road how dare you walk in our road they never thought this forest belongs to the bears also it is their home we are only going inside and disturbing the human being did not realize they got angry we can't drive fast you are coming in between they have taken away the bear so that is why this meeting is on so the lion king lion is telling so see we have told the human beings we allowed them to make the road it's okay but we told them to put one big sign board saying animal crossing here so drive slow but they put the board but they did not put it properly in one day the board got spoiled the rain came all the letters got washed away even the board they did not put it properly because of the rain and the wind it just fell down so there is no sign board saying animals are crossing here so that is also very bad from the human beings and you know the elephant told see we are not making any mistakes the mistakes are done by the human beings they make mistakes they do crime normally who will get punished whoever makes the mistake only will get punished no here human beings make the mistake they make blunders but the punishment is for us what did we do we did not do anything no we simply happily we want to live in our house which is the forest and elephant said also i want to tell you one thing we are not crossing the road the road is only crossing into our forest don't you agree children in yes, the forest we are going and putting the road 
the forest is not we, we are not doing anything i mean uh, animals are not doing anything road is only crossing disturbing the animals and now the lion said yes i agree telling them talking to them asking them to put a sign board allowing them to make a road inside our forest they did not listen to us at all they are not human beings they are inhuman no empathy for anybody so now we have to take action first anyway simply we cannot go on strike we can't go and punish somebody we'll do one thing we will make our ask our monkeys to go and talk to the human beings the monkeys some have started learning how to talk to human beings in the forest so monkeys will go and tell them ask them to make some speed breakers ask them to put a sign board ask them to drive slowly if they agree we will live peacefully along with the other i mean human beings if not we will make them realize we will give them a nice action plan they will never forget so now the monkeys went and talked to the officers sitting there so they told please put a sign board make some speed breakers ask all the vehicle drivers to go slowly inside the forest do not pollute our house and do not honk bang 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 do not honk and don't throw the glass bottles and hurt our friends but the human officers you know they did not accept hello you we you don't you have to listen to us because we are human beings okay we don't listen to you if we permit you to stay only you can stay who are you to come and ask us we go to school we go to college we build our houses we make roads we invent new new technology who are what have you guys done you are living in the forest you live in the forest you will be living in the forest we are not going to listen to you they refuse to listen to them now what should the animals do what do you think children take action take action what kind of action can you recommend block what the road you can take block the road block the road superb yes of course block the road now the lion said no more patience we went and talked to them they did not listen to us now all of us have to block the road not only simply blocking the road can a rabbit go and block the road no can a snake go and block the road no no which are the strongest animals in the forest elephant lion lion then elephant elephant, elephant. elephant. tiger elephant. other animals other strong animals leopard cheetah leopard lion king tiger. Ah, cheetah giraffe tiger, giraffe ajayanti uh, aunty bear giraffe bear bear you know bear is the strongest animal it is even more stronger than the lion you know bears are yeah. very strong animals bear comes and give you one slap fine you will fall dead yeah. you want to try you can go and stay in the forest stand before the bear hey i will kill you bear will say sha go one slap dead so bears are very strong animals so everybody decided from today we'll all go and stand on the road we will block the vehicles not for one hour two hour three hours for days together we will not let them go so elephants bears giraffes tigers cheetahs all the animals came they came and they blocked the vehicles 
they they were like going round and round you imagine you are sitting inside the car and seven elephants are going around your car how you will feel <laughs> they can Have break you? the windows also the ah door. glasses yeah. glasses they can why breaking the glass they'll they just lift the car and tumble your car mm -hmm. like like gilli tand no we used to play no stick no. ball mm. so, gorilla gorilla gorillas are stronger gorillas are even yeah. more stronger no mm. than monkeys the all the animals came yeah. and blocked the road one day oh. gone they thought animals will be hungry oh. they will go somewhere to drink water eat food they they human beings thought they instead of crossing the road why yeah. these animals are troubling the animals the elephants are standing here cheetahs are standing there these animals are jobless or what but animals are kangaroos are also different. strong yeah which one kangaroos kangaroos but we don't have kangaroos no in australia only we have isn't it new zealand australia but we don't have by nature we don't have it so all the animals came and blocked the road for days together nowadays what we have we have mobiles no so immediately everybody called everybody they called they called minister they called officers they wrote in the social media twitter facebook everywhere they wrote so animals are blocking i think something is wrong come and save us we are very scared we have children we have elders we have old people cheetahs are coming and sitting on our bonnet tigers are coming and standing on our boot behind and who is coming and knocking the windows the bears are coming and tok 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 knocking the windows they come and do mm, like that how will you feel you'll get a heart attack no you are very scared we can't fight with them so everybody is like messaging messaging social media is flooded with messages and then all the officers came why 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 what's happening why can't we go this animals are bad but the animals stood very strongly there the monkeys went and told them hello we came no yesterday we asked you to do certain can we put some conditions to make us live happily in our house but you people did not listen you thought everything belong to you the world has been created for you that is not fair you want to live you live happily but don't trouble others so that is why if you continue to do we will also continue to do the same thing we'll see how you will cross the road we will close the road nice no and now everybody all the human beings officers they just bowed down and said we are so sorry we made a mistake we made a crime actually coming into your house and we make you suffer and then they called and said bring that bear back back to the forest so they brought the bear also back to the forest and they agreed <laughs> they'll put speed breakers they'll put speed limit and they will put the sign boards so nobody should honk inside the forest do not disturb the calmness of the forest let the animals live happily in their forest yes wolves are also strong of course okay so that is the end of the story and beginning of the happiness in the forest so what should we also do when we go driving with our dad or mom or anybody should never even inside the city should never honk ba 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 sometimes some people no they'll always be they won't drive on the accelerator they don't know where to turn only horn ba irritating no the brain gets suffocating annoyed irritated 
correct so hospitals you know in near my house there is one hospital that road is a busy road every time near the hospital there will be ambulances also no patients will be coming getting down we should give them some time no to go into the hospital these people you know they come in big big cars and big big bikes they keep on bang 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 keep on honking near in front of the hospital everybody has gone to school college they are doing working very well earning in lakhs earning in crores huge cars they have but if you are in that car will you allow such things to happen children never sound pollution hmm so that is the story written by kannikovil raja mama this is a wonderful book okay so tomorrow we are going to review this book also i'll share the link you can watch the link right okay nice did you enjoy the story how was the story did you like yeah shri vidya i want to say something tell shri vidya say next tuesday i'm going to the singapore zoo oh really okay you go on school uh, our teacher is bringing us oh your teachers are taking you enjoy enjoy that and come back and share your experiences okay how was the animals could you speak to the animal what are they eating first of all can we keep them in the zoo also you tell okay how big space they need elephants walk 50 okay anusha bye thank you anusha bye thank you see you you know elephants walk at least 50 kilometers per day can we give that much space in the zoo but if we can't keep in the zoo we can't see the animals correct so somewhere we have to make a balance so shri vidya will share her experience next week by the way children next week we don't have a story session 14th we don't have a story session okay we'll do it from the next week 21st onwards okay right jainti aunty mm. yeah i want to ask a question to the children why do they build roads uh, and uh, other things in the forest mm. why do they build why do we have to go to forest they don't come to our cities but in the forest why do we go for what to purpose? cut trees oh, okay cut okay so we need the trees okay. okay to stay for what to build more houses to build more houses eh? ah why in the forest because there is no place eh? in cities so slowly we are occupying the forest eh? is it that sri hari wanted to to build houses okay what else why do we cut the mountains this rock mountains and uh, think about it okay why do we why do we go to forest uh, why do they build what else we get from the mountains okay think about it and tell next week okay Okay, that's all. Shri Vidya, what do you want to show? We are showing Kaniko El Raja Mama's book. Appa, Echika. Hmm. Hmm. Why you wanted to show that book? Ah, Shri Hari has a book. Why do you want to show that book? Why do you want to show that book? Why do you want to show that book? I also have so many books. Hmm. ஜிக்னேஷ்ரிஜாய்ஸ்ரீஹரி அண்ட் ஸ்ரீ வித்யா ஆர் டோல்டு பியூட்டிஃபுல் ஸ்டோரி 
you children also tell good story tell us no come okay okay right you all shall i stop recording super